What's up guys, Orca just released this uh, update an hour ago, so I want to make a quick video because this looks like a fairly simple process and it looks pretty similar across all goggles. So I have the FPV-1 Pilot, or the V2 goggles, and pretty much what you're gonna do is download this file right here. I'll leave a link to this down in the description. Uh, click this, it's gonna bring you to the Orca page, download the appropriate firmware for your goggles. Again, I have the V2s, so I'm gonna download that gonna do is I believe we're just unzipping the file putting it on a formatted SD card and putting it in the goggles after the goggles have already turned on so go to my downloads and unzip it so this is what we're gonna drag onto the SD card so I'm gonna take the SD card out of my goggles put it on my computer and we'll just drag those files over to it. All right, so I'm going to format the SD card. Make sure you don't have anything important on here. If you do, get it off. <laughs> format, I'm gonna do that right there. Start. Yeah, I know. I know what formatting does. Cool, so now we got drive F completely blank. So there's drive F or the SD card that's gonna go in the goggles and that's what we need to put in it. So now I'm gonna just do that. Now let's plug it into the goggles, turn them on and see what happens. All right, I'm gonna plug it in. Get the bootloader mode, SD card with the new firmware on it, put it in. Here's some beeps. Goggles will turn off automatically after a few seconds. Turn the goggles on again, wait for the update process to complete. Get loading, please wait. Firmware update in progress, so it's updating to the new firmware. All right, let's power cycle the goggles real quick. cable. Look at that. Got the menu system. Looks like it's working good. Very nice. Good job, Orca.